All right, you guys. You know me. I love Jesus. This is by far one of my favorite songs, and I'm just really happy somebody recommended it because I want to listen to it anyways. If you haven't listened to this, if you're not even Christian or if you're atheist or you're Muslim, I don't even think it matters because I truly believe that this song can touch anybody because I truly believe that Jesus made everybody. I mean, a lot of you are going to be really judgmental on the way that I that I feel about these songs and stuff like that, but millions and billions of people can't be wrong. My life was changed pretty quick. It's kind of mind blowing. And I'm just going to throw this out there. If anybody wants to know my story and why I feel the way that I feel about Jesus, you can always ask. You can message me or comment down below. I'll gladly share my story or gladly share my experience. So... Good life. I used to doubt. I mean, I've always, I've always loved Jesus Christ growing up. You know, I've always loved him, but I never really believed in that. You know what I mean? I never really believed in anything. I was really confused. You know, you're taught one thing in school, and then you're taught one thing elsewhere, and then you got people in your life that are telling you one thing and then the other. So I was just very confused for a very long time. But who I am today, there's absolutely no doubt in my mind. Like everything that I am screams from Jesus now. It's remarkable. All the good that's in me is not me. Well, yes, it is me, but it has a lot to do with God and Jesus Christ. Like, I give all that glory to God. If it was up to me, I'd probably be, well, whatever.
I think where I was going with that is without God's guidance and the Holy Spirit kind of like changing me within, I very well would be in prison probably right now or something like that. Probably get myself into some kind of trouble, stupid trouble. kind of talk throughout this entire video, or music video, but, <clears throat> yeah, I guess what I'll, I will say is just a little bit about me and kind of where things took a change uh, was actually when I was in the Marines, kind of was just doing me, and I... It was when I was back from Afghanistan. I had looked for roadside bombs. I was a combat engineer. And uh, I was blown up three times. Direct hits. And uh, not, not saying that that has anything to do with my faith or anything, but I kind of went through a lot of mental battles when I got back, and I was definitely experiencing a lot a lot of physical differences like my stomach was different and like just the way that my body was working like I was super anxious anyways I couldn't do deal with it on my own and I had nowhere else to go I was in the desert nowhere else to go so I just gave it all up to Jesus Christ I mean I was drinking very heavily I was popping pills uh, do, you know smoking dipping you know it was it was just a a constant cycle of just trying to mask it or trying to just medicate I guess and tried on my own so hard to stop and like be good and all this kind of stuff just couldn't do it on my own and then I just gave it up to Jesus one night and like my life completely changed so the Holy Spirit can do a lot of things and I know there's a lot of skeptics out there I was one of them uh, but millions and billions of people are going through or went through the same thing that I went through when I accepted Jesus. So uh, there's really nothing. I'm going to be living for Jesus for the rest of my life. Forever. I love him very much. And he loves you. He definitely loves you. And what I will say is he understands. That's probably one of the biggest things, is Jesus really does understand. He's not trying to hurt you. He doesn't want to send you to hell. He doesn't, you know, he, he, he did what he did to save your ass. So he's just eagerly hoping that you accept him, not the other way around. It's not hoping that he'll accept you. It's literally just waiting for you to come to him. And no matter where you are in life, he's going to accept you promise. Alright guys, I love you with all my heart. Talk to you later.